Okay. Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey at Red Color, and this is Nancy Jean in the Garden. We are the Daily Duo. We, we read dually on five energies. The energies that we read on are body, mind, spirit, grounding, and clarity. I read five tarot cards. Nancy Jean reads five crystals in the garden. Mm -hmm. And then we have a little spiritual, hopeful, lovely message for you, hopefully. Um, <laughs> uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. Please become members of our respective channels. And do you have anything you want to add? Yeah, we're, I'm running a special on the garden right now. And it's, um, if you go to my website, www.crystaldirections.com, that's in the description below. It Go to the store and it'll explain all about how to do this. I'm opening up a membership for people who own the garden to be able to learn how to read it. Um, since this kind of was sent to me, I ch channeled this in last year. And uh, the other thing is that I'm doing a nine candle ceremony. It started on the 12th. So this will be day three, and uh, if you'd like to tune into that, it's a uh, time for us to get ready for the summer solstice, which is on the 21st, and that's it. Oh, and today, by the way, is the full moon. That's true. All day long. All day. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. So... First off, I have um, okay, first off, my full moon message was basically find the thing that you love to do and do more of it. That was my basic message. Mm -hmm. Which, you know, great, right? And now, so I'm looking at these cards. I have three sevens. I have three sevens. So That's sevens great. are all about, yeah, sevens are all about confidence. Sevens are mm -hmm. all about like, you can do it, rah, rah, rah. Rah, rah, rah. I wish I had those things, but I don't. All right. Um, okay. So for body, it's like you've taken a lot of action. You've planted a lot of seeds and know that they're going to grow. Be confident in, mm -hmm. um, you know, the things that you've already done. And, you know, the things that have yet to come back and, you know, bloom. Body, mind. Mind says, yeah, I, you know, <clears throat> I think you should go after what you want. Interesting that this should come up on the full moon, right? Right. Um, it, it, you know, there's this energy in this card. I, to me, this is like the spiritual quest. Right. So there's this energy, and, but, but it's not, this is not burning bridges. This is like, I have something established already and it's satisfying, but I kind of, Feel like I want more. I kind of feel like I want more. Mm -hmm. and my my message is, yeah, good. Go get it. <laughs> Body, mind, spirit, and, but choose wisely. Choose mm -hmm. wisely, right? Body, mind, spirit. Grounding. This is a great card for grounding. Grounding is like you're established. You're mm -hmm. supported. Um, it's fruitful. Mm -hmm. And then for clarity, this is an interesting card. So for clarity, it's like, have faith in your own mind. Have faith in the thoughts that you're thinking. Have faith that your ideas are correct. Mm -hmm. you know? Don't second guess. It's a, you know, and a lot of times when people are like, oh, I don't really know what my intuition says. It's like, what's your first thing that came up? Generally, what your first thing that came up is the right thing. Right. That's pretty much where it goes. So. There's a sense of uh, moving forward. There's a sense of we've got you. There's a sense of you can go out and get whatever you want. Right. Away. Yes. And I have the body in go for it. And that means movement at this time is easy. It's also a little bit in water, which means you're, the things you're embodying are, are moving forward. So it's really a great deal. Then if you read this one, the... Uh, grounding stone fell in true and when it shows up it says you're seeing everything very clearly great and your clarity stone says you're learning from lessons of the past what you're thinking about and where you're thinking about going is grounded in 
things you've done in this life or skills you brought forward from your past life. Mm -hmm. And then your mind is in earth. And as we know, earth's where things grow and emerge from. And it's right on the line. And I looked at it closely. It's really all in earth. And your mind says final thoughts for the situation are coming. But then you get your spirit. And if you look, I mean, this is, it's cut exactly in half between the present and the future. And what happens to the spirit when it gets caught in that space is transmutation is coming, but not quite ready. But the spiritual changes are happening right now, mm -hmm. but they're not complete. Mm -hmm. So you're still having to mull over a little bit from here. But man, when you've got the body and go for it, whenever anything's in go for it, it means go for it. What you're feeling right now is true and valid. So follow it forward. Yeah, it's almost like uh, you're planning a big trip mm -hmm. the night before, and you're packed and you're ready to go. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Got your tickets, got online, got your little tickets booked. Everything, all your ducks are in a row. Okay, well, that's, that's your 14th full moon. Have blessings. <laughs>